many of us have a hard time living in this moment and not worrying about all the things that we have to do next week or next month or oh my goodness, I have this coming up, I have this bill coming up. Who has a hard time living in the now and not worrying or stressing because I know so many people can be like that. I used to be like that. Sometimes I still have moments where I struggle to live in the now, like this moment right here, right now. I'm gonna teach you a trick, Lisa, to where it can help you kind of live more in the moment. So first of all, we're not supposed to stress about the future. I know that sounds weird, right? Like how am I not gonna stress about the future? I have all these things coming. I have all these things I have to do. We're not supposed to stress about the future. We're supposed to live in the moment right now. My favorite thing to do is to win the day. So we're supposed to win this day right now, right here. Andy Frisello's podcast is kind of a big deal for a lot of people that listen to it. Um, it's like made, it's really opened a lot of people up in their marketing, like really gave some mindset realizations, really helped people in how to set their goals. So when you make the commitment to win the day, you need to think of five critical tasks five critical tasks so think about the things that you need to do for the day now i'm not talking about every little goal that you have oh, okay i want to write this blog post and i want to send this email and i want to do this and i want to do that and you want to have like 20 million things on your list no only five no less than five five critical tasks that move you closer and closer and closer to your goal so in the podcast, they say it's about five times a day doing something that makes you a little bit uncomfortable. So think about those things. And then when you can like get them all scratched off your list, you put a W on the page. So you put a W, W, because you just won a day. So it's kind of like a, a way to get you to really focus on quality, not quantity because you were trying to do the important stuff, the critical tasks that are gonna get you there. So this is my list for today. Um, it's backwards. The so number one, personal development. Number two, create content, which for me was six pins. My goal is to create six pins a day for the content that I have created because I'm learning Pinterest. You guys have heard me talk about it in my videos. I'm learning how to market on Pinterest, so I know that I need to be creating those things. I need to tally, actually, how many pins I've made today. I think I've made two pins today. So I have four more pins to make, so I have to go over my Over app and make those graphics. Um, go live on the Perch page. I need to cross that off. So that was my number three. Number four, create mailing list newsletter post. I had to send out my newsletter today. It was super late. It was halfway through the month. I've been so busy, but you know what? No excuses. I got it done. Even though I was 16 days late, I changed it to the mid-October newsletter because I still wanted to make sure that I win the day. Like, this is important. And then number five, align with business partner and share importance of us combining our marketing training. Like, so we had a meeting today to discuss what kind of marketing each of us are going to learn about what we're going to do because we both... We're both two different entrepreneurs. We both have different goals, even though we are partners. We get together and we discuss our goals and what we want to do in our marketing. So we did that today and I got to cross it off my list. And business partner conversations can be a tad bit uncomfortable sometimes because sometimes you're just like, okay, like, are we in alignment? Are we agreeing? How can we get to the place we need to go? And it went beautifully. It was perfect. We had so, I always have great meetings with her, but that was something that was on my power list that I really needed to take care of. So I've crossed out four things on my list so far. And then when I cross out those other two, I win the day. But here's the trick. You have to be honest with yourself. You don't always win every day. So if you fail to complete everything on that list, you have to put an L on the page because you just lost that day. At the end of the week, you want more W's than L's. You want to win that week. And then after that, you want to win the month. Think about all those W's adding up and you could win the year. You write out power list at the top and then you write one, two, three, four, five critical tasks that you need to do. I can give you ideas on tasks you could do. Like if you're wanting to do social media marketing, like number one, I would recommend personal development for 30 minutes. 
Number two, I would recommend marketing training for 30 minutes. So even if you're watching these videos or going on Pinterest and finding things and finding helpful tips, I have a lot of really cool boards that can help you with marketing on Pinterest. I can send you the link. Number three, create content so you could write out, you know, what you want to talk about in your next live video or what you're going to post about, plan your posts around things or things of that nature. Number four could be to go live. And number five could be to network with your friends, comment on people's posts, message people, interact, engage with people for at least one hour. So bam, five things right there for your power list. It's hard sometimes to think of those things. Once you have something become a habit from that list, you're not gonna put it on your power list anymore once it becomes a habit. So let's say you've been doing it for a while and it's become a habit, it's become second nature. You're gonna remove that from your list and you're gonna add something else. Wanna, Think about like every single detail, every single scene. Just visually imagine everything that will show up in your ideal future, your ideal like successful life. Everything that you can think of. Next, you want to think about mindset. So with the power list, you do not have to believe in yourself yet. That's what's so amazing about it. You don't have to believe in yourself. You don't have to be there. All you have to do is win the day. So let's say your mindset is just not quite with it yet, but you can complete those five critical tasks and you can win the day. So first, I have my power list. Now at the top of your list, you're gonna write your, like your goal. So what are you working to? What are you trying to achieve? Mine right here says, you know, I wanna earn a thousand dollars. I wanna save up a thousand dollars to fix my car. I have that at the top of my list right now. And I'm gonna look at that goal and then I'm gonna win the day. I'm gonna win the day. I'm gonna keep winning these days and I'm gonna know that the hard work's gonna pay off. So you don't even necessarily have to believe you're gonna achieve that goal. Play to win the day. Don't play to think about that goal. Just write it up there and ignore it. Forget that it's there. Play to win the day and then just do it. Just do the list, the feeling, the gratification, the excitement of winning will get you through it every single day. You'll like the feeling of winning. You'll you'll be a winner. Say hi, say hello. And then you'll actually win at that big goal. This five critical task helps you do the quality work that you need to do. She's having so much fun. I'm sorry for the noise. Also, let me tell you today when I was working on that newsletter and I was going through as I was creating content and inserting all the links, I noticed mistakes that I had made in my events on the graphics or whatever, and I was able to fix those as I went. So just imagine all the things that you're gonna run into as you do those five critical tasks that you're gonna kill and crush for the day. I mean, because entrepreneurs are busy. We have a lot going on. So it's important for us to have a way to organize things so we can live in the present. I'm living in the right now. I'm making sure that I win today. And then tomorrow, I'm not worried about tomorrow. I'm worried about today. I'm gonna win today. I'm gonna cross off that, cross off everything on my list, put that W on there, and I'm gonna win. And then you know what? Tomorrow I'm gonna win again. And the next day I'm gonna win again. Whenever you can actually like focus on what you're doing at that moment and on that day, everything else is out of reach. It doesn't matter that you're a work in progress, it's okay. Keep doing it, keep winning the day. You can be active without being productive. So imagine how often we're we're doing things or we think we're doing things that we're really not being productive. So just hustling doesn't mean that you're gonna be successful. You have to hustle like in a smart way, in an intelligent way. You have to you have to be meticulous in what you do. You have to make sure that you're completing the critical task so that you have quality over quantity. In order to be productive, I don't have to work 40 hours and I can earn just as much Stop that! <laughs> so me, it doesn't matter how many hours. Time doesn't ne necessarily mean that you're putting in the work. So in this situation, you can really narrow it down and make a power list and win the day and live in the present and then you can achieve your goals for the future. So doesn't that just blow your mind that you can live in the right now? Winning the day right now will help you reach your goal. Let me tell you something about this Apple Watch, baby. Okay, this Apple Watch right here, it was on my power list. Had it in one week. 
Let me tell you something about my astrology software. I'm an astrologer. I had this goal that I was gonna be able to connect with my clients and have my own software and be able to reach them and do my own birth chart interpretations and be able to map out their charts that was a very expensive software, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars. I had it in three days. It was on my power list for such a short time. When I make a power list, I get determined and I don't play any games. And you know what? I was, a, I was excited about winning that goal. I knew I was gonna win that goal. It didn't seem so far out of the reach because I believed in myself and my mindset was there. But I was more worried about winning the day. I was more, I wasn't really worried about it. I was excited to win the day. I was happy, I was pumped. So right now, you know what? I am excited to win these can days so I can get the money to fix my car. Can you wash my what are your goals? What is something that you really need in your life right now? What is a goal for you that seems so far away that you're having a hard time reaching it? Drop them in the comments for me. So let me know if power lists are helpful for you. Let me know if you're using them. But I love you guys. Thank you so much for connecting with me. Um, if this brought you value at all, please share it to your page. I would love to connect with your friends. And um, I will talk to you all later. Say bye. Say bye, bye. babies.